Hello everyone and welcome back to Little Book's Great Stories. Today's book is Pinkalicious and the Sick Day. I hate being sick and having to miss a day at school, especially when it's a special day like Pinkalicious's. So subscribe to Little Book's Great Stories and let's read! Pinkalicious and the Sick Day when the bell rang at the end of the day, Principal Hart handed me a letter. Give this to your mom, she said. Uh-oh, was I in trouble? When I got home, I found Mommy. I waited while she read the letter. Mommy smiled. You have perfect attendance. Tomorrow, you get to be principal for the day, she said. I'm very proud of you. Yippee! I yelled. I'm in charge. No homework. I don't know about that, Mommy said. However, you do get to read the morning announcements and eat lunch with Principal Hart. After dinner, I worked on my announcer's voice. Good morning, students, I said. Bravo, Pinkalicious, Daddy said. You must be very excited. Your cheeks are all pink. I nodded. I was excited, but I was also very sleepy. I went to bed early. When I woke up, my head hurt, my eyes itched, my throat felt scratchy. Achoo, achoo, achoo! Dad took my temperature. You have a fever, he said. No school for you today. He tucked me back into bed. Then I remembered. I have to go to school, I said. I am principal for the day. I'm sorry, Pinkalicious, Mommy said. I'll make you some tea, said Mommy. Daddy tried to cheer me up. He put my favorite books on my bed. Then he gave me a big hug and I went back to sleep. I woke up feeling a bit better, but I still had the sniffles. I looked in the mirror. My nose was perfectly pink. Mommy came in with pink tea. My mom used to make this for me when I was sick, she said. It's elderberry tea. I took a sip. Yum. I got to stay in my pajamas all day. Mommy brought me crayons and I colored in bed. I drew a picture of me riding Goldie to school. Daddy called from work to see how I was. He told me a joke to make me laugh. Why did the pink panda go to the doctor's office? Because she was pink! I giggled, but I was still a little sad because I wasn't at school. I would not be able to share the joke at recess. In the afternoon, the phone rang. It was Principal Hart. I'm homesick too, she said. When you come back, you can still be principal for the day. I felt a pink a million times better. Then Peter came home. Guess what I did today, I said. I colored and I read books. Mommy made me pink tea and I didn't even have to get dressed. I want to be sick too, said Peter. Then he smelled my cold medicine. Yuck, forget it, he said. I giggled. The next morning, my nose was a normal color and I felt all better. Your temperature is normal, Mommy said. You can go to school today. Yay! I cheered. When I got to school, I went straight to the office. I couldn't wait to tell everyone the joke about the pink panda. Good morning, I said. This is Principal Pink Alicious. Thank you for listening to today's Read Aloud. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and stay tuned for more.